I'm Mr. Lawrence. I'm going to demonstrate how we're going to use view.com and also show document for our collaborative work. I'm a teacher and I'm going to teach my student how to set up a meeting room or a web seminar room. So I'm going to show you view.com first. Set up this is the meeting room. I set up six different meeting rooms bio, discussion room, blog, blog URL, chemistry, tutorial, and Prezi. These are the discussion site. I'm going to invite my students when I click down here. I can always invite my students, collaborate with my students for group discussion. This is one site, an excellent site for collaborative work with my students. Click on the meeting room again. I have got my bio 2002 November discussion group which I'm going to discuss with them and collaborate with them today so I uploaded this exam paper this is the exam paper and the students can always write down their comment these are their comment these are the comment these are the answers so they're going to key in their answers these are examples that I've shown you three of them is going to work together on this paper 2002 November paper so three students is going to work together to get this work done so these are the questions and they're going to key in their answers together and working collaboratively online real time an excellent site for collaborative work viveview.com and the other one which is another meeting room, special meeting room. This site here, show document, is an, another excellent site. I created, like sign in, created a web meeting or document sharing. I'm gonna upload a file. So I'm gonna launch my application now, file sharing. I'm the host. I'm going to invite my students. So I'm going to upload my exam paper. My exam paper will be 2002 November. It's a bio exam paper. I'm going to upload the paper to be discussed with my students. And once it's uploaded, I will invite three students to discuss and to work collaborative on this paper, on a bio paper. So I scroll down and these are the tools they can always key in key in their answer down here and they can always make marking they can write they can do whatever they want highlight and three of them three students will be working on this particular paper if not then they're going to key in their answers down here this is example which I'm showing you right now so one of the students will be the host now I'm the host you can invite participants down here you click on invite and you send them invitation you got a key in there email address email address so click on OK once all this done you got to save their work and PDF it for discussion an excellent site show document for collaborative work and the other one which I mentioned earlier which is Y view two excellent sites.